Phillies hosting the Astros World Series game number five. The Astros are minus 160 on the money line. The Phillies are plus 135. The over under is seven and a half runs. The Astros laying a run and a half are plus 110, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two. While the Phillies getting a run and a half are minus 130, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Verland has pitched against the Phillies twice this year. Five innings, no runs, no earn. They won that game five to nothing. He also pitched against the Phillies in game one. Five innings, five runs, five earned. They lost that game six to five and ten. Syndergaard did pitch against the Astros twice this year. It was a member of the Angels and not the Phillies. Five inning, five and a third, no runs, no earned. They won two nothing. Four innings, three runs, three earned. They lost that game six to five. The Astros are six and four as a team in Verlander's last ten starts. He's averaging five and a third innings pitched and seven strikeouts per game in his last ten. Syndergaard. Has uh, the Phillies have won his last two starts? He's they're six and four in his last ten appearances. He's averaging four and a third innings pitched in his last ten, and two point three strikeouts per game in his last ten. Now, mind you, they were using him a lot in relief. Now, head to head, the Astros are six and four against the Phillies in their last ten. The under has hit in their last two games. The under is five four and one. The under seven and a half is six and four. The favorite is either six and four and seven and three on the money line. It just depends on if you got the Astros as a favorite in game four or the Astros as an underdog in game four. The team getting or laying runs is either five and five. And yet again, that depends upon how you got the Astros in the last game. If you got them as a favorite, then the team laying a run and a half is six and four. If you got them as an underdog, then it's five and five. I'm going to take the Astros with the money line. I will take the Phillies getting the runs. I just think that this will be a closer game than it probably should be later on in the game due to the bullpen. And I'm going to go under in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.